This is the number one reason making people feel stuck in a job or a business that they do not enjoy doing. And that is called a region beta paradox. I'm sharing with you today my uh, experience in client advisory since 2012. So ensure you save this. Region beta paradox. This term refers to a scenario in which you know that you are settling for less than you deserve or you are capable of but you do not do anything about it simply because you are comfortable in your current situation even if that situation is making you feel uh, unhappy or unfulfilled like a mundane repetitive job scope that does not make you feel challenged or grow as a person now comfortable can mean any one of or more of this right you have like a stable income and it pays the bill uh, you have a routine work days you know you have mild to no stress uh, company provides decent benefits you have all your familiar colleague and you know your boss is not too terrible lah. in essence uh, people do not perceive that the, their situation is being bad enough to justify a change but what is the danger of staying in this region beta paradox because you become complacent it's prevents you it, it prevents you from reaching your full potential and can lead to in long term downward spiral that is hard to escape from like a deteriorating mental health because the longer you stay in that region beta paradox and the longer you stay the harder it, it is to get out but the fact is it happens every day it happens everywhere your boss or even your next cubicle colleague may appear to be motivated and happy when you see them in the office but that is just a mask that they could be wearing because in our line of advisory work, uh, clients often can need to take off their mask and tell us what they really feel. Most of them are earning, you know, a great income, you know, from a society point of point of view, you know, a T twenty level kind of income, and they are in positions or in professions that many others would only dream of doing. But they are dragging themselves to work to office five days a week. You know, they feel very disengaged from work day in and day out. So what to do about it? You have to recognize that if you are in this region beta paradox, you are in a zone of being comfortable yet frustrating complacency, ask yourself these questions. Am I happy with my current situation? Am I doing what I love daily? And are you feeling that you feel alive and you feel fulfilled? You be honest with yourself. And if the answer is no, then you may have some reflection to do. But reflection without implementation, without any change is procrastination. So actually the last step uh, for people who are self-aware and they want to make a change is they have to get unstuck from this region beta paradox. Uh, that could be a difficult thing to do, uh, do, doing it yourself, especially if you are already trapped in this downward spiral, right? For long, it may be beneficial for you to ask for actionable advice or guidance, but do not let the fear of un un unknown paralyze you from inaction, from living the life that you deserve. Because it's sad uh, to wake up and realize, you know, that you have just spent 10 years in the wrong job or in the wrong business or in the wrong company. There should be no reason for you to settle to being mediocre. You have really real opportunity to be a more fulfilled version of you. But realistically speaking, having financial stability is the first step or the primary enabler for you to make the change, uh, be it in the form of, you know, a career break or early retirement from, you know, what you're doing right now. So basically, this is what I have to share. But if what I'm saying resonates with you and you understand the value of unbiased advice, uh, there's a link in bio to reach out and see. You can also check out our clients' feedback over there in the link in my link in bio. If uh, you have gone towards whereby you enter your contact details to be contacted, then you reach out and we see if there's a good fit for you to undergo a personal financial readiness and situation analysis. Uh, to prepare yourself for a career break or career transition or even early retirement.